Hello. I have an important message for all the agnostics, but really it's also for everyone. Because we are dying, and we do not know if there is an afterlife. Everyone should acknowledge this fact of our ignorance. And as long as we cannot prove that there is any gods to save us, as long as we cannot prove there is an afterlife, everyone should be urgently trying to live forever physically in any way possible. Life extension might be our only chance to live forever and to not die. You have to ask yourself, what's the point of your existence if you die and stop existing? Don't you love life? Don't you want to stay alive and still be able to do all the things you enjoy, all your passions and your hobbies in life? This is why we urgently need to support life extension research. We need to support Aubrey de Grey. Research Aubrey de Grey and Laura Deming and Cynthia Kenyon. These people are doing amazing things to help us all possibly live forever if we can develop therapies in time. And there's hope. There is hope for you, whoever you are, whoever's watching this. If we push this movement forward, we need to push agnosticism forward because all these people who say that they know there's an afterlife, they don't know. They don't know. We can't let them get away with this nonsense anymore. We need to challenge this. People pretending to know that there's an afterlife. It's ridiculous. So if you're a supporter of life extension, let's get all the religious people to realize their, their mistake. So many religious people are risking their eternal life based upon the assumption that there is an afterlife. This, this, is, this is crazy. This is a completely illogical. And um, this is important. This is important. All our eternal life is at stake. And the more people we can get to support life extension, the better it's going to be for all of us. So we need to put the fear of death into these people. These people have no fear of death because they just assume there's an afterlife. They have this comforting idea that there's going to be some afterlife after they die. So that's why I created the agnostic code. Because no one knows. And if you claim to know if there's a God or if there's an afterlife, you need to start over and learn how to think logically. Get back to the drawing board. Have the humility of doubt. Oh, you should never, never doubt what nobody is sure about. The humility of uncertainty. No one can know these things. The knowledge of God's existence is inaccessible to human beings. If, you, if there's something where there is doubt, don't claim you're certain. So, we're dying. We're dying. We need to live forever. We cannot let these, our bodies die. This is, this is like... I hope you get how important this is. This is nothing more important than your, etern than your eternal life. This is serious business. That's, uh, um, that's it for this video, but um, follow the agnostic code on Facebook forward slash the agnostic code. Same with YouTube forward slash the agnostic code. And um, let's, let's push this movement of agnosticism forward. Let's push doubt because no one knows and everyone should be afraid to die we need to live forever physically so that's the message goodbye thank you for watching
disease. It's like any other. And there's a cure. A cure. And I will find it. 